posterior, okay, and anterior. Actually, there's two more things. Eventually, when I looked into the, the film, the, the film, the uh, smooth side, the white side, has a little dot or pimple. You can feel it, okay? The dot has to be always mounted towards the by block. Either this is an upper x-ray, lower, left or right. As long as you mount it, see it is right there. What I do is uh, I'll mark it. It's right here. Okay? The you see dot it? The dot goes in the slot. The dot to the slot, right. So here we go. Okay, see how it's facing the uh, towards the uh, by block or the slot. Okay, that's it could be for upper, lower, left, or right. So it's for the upper. That will be for for the lower. Okay, the dot still towards the uh, slot. That's easier for mounting. And also there is other purposes that I will get into that as well. Okay, so it will be. Like that. For Dexters, you can, so you can get used to it, kind of paint it like I did just the first few times. Later, don't do it, because you don't, you don't want to do that on a patient. Then you'll be contaminating the film with the ink and the pen or whatever, so no. This is just for uh, uh, practice and instructional purpose only, okay? Same thing for the anterior teeth. Same principle, there is the, Right there. Okay, again, this is for upper. One, two, and three. For the lowers, you don't do anything, just flip it. One, two, and three. The dot towards the uh, slot or towards the by block. Very important that you do that, okay? There is another thing I wanted to share. Let me see. By block. Your teeth. I guess uh, for now, yeah, that's it. There's something else I want to remember and I'll let you know. Okay? Any other info? Okay. Now, so we're going to actually go into another topic, which is the best friend you're going to have for the next 